proud parents, family, friends, and most importantly, the class of 2020. Congratulations on your accomplishments and thank you for allowing me to be with each of you today to share in this momentous occasion. To the graduates, this is a day that will be part of your story for the rest of your lives. You should be proud of what you have done while also recognizing the support from family and friends that helped you get this far. I know this isn't exactly the kind of graduation that you have had in mind. You did all the work, studied hard, passed the exams, then along comes this invisible enemy that we call COVID-19 to turn your world upside down. I'm sure you wanted your moment to walk across the stage and receive your diploma like everyone else. This pandemic has taken that from you, but what it has not taken is what no person or circumstance can ever change is the fact that you set out on a mission to transform the way you think, to open new doors and to prepare yourselves for success. And that mission was accomplished. Yes, you have had to make some adjustments in this unprecedented time, but you adapted and you overcame these unforeseen circumstances that you had really no control over. The graduating class of 2020 has a unique distinction of being unlike any other graduating class in recent history. You were thrown a curveball in the middle of what should have been a time of celebration. It was the ninth inning. Each of you hit the ball out of the park. You were coming in for the home run and then someone moved home plate. What do you do when something like that happens? First, you remember that you have prepared yourself to think and to adjust because you have invested in yourself by investing in a higher education. You are a leader and people will look for you for direction and purpose. You have to keep making the big plays. While the world is going to look a little different now, you have already shown that you will not be defeated in trying times. You have a perspective that prepares you to deal with challenges and disappointments, to keep pressing forward when those obstacles are put in, put in your way and uh, to adapt and persevere when the original plan doesn't go exactly like it was designed. The world sees the class of 2020 as a distinct group of leaders and trailblazers who have figured out a way to navigate in these unusual times. With your new role comes a new responsibility. Of course, you can just take your degree and continue with your life as it has been. Or you can use these new skills and knowledge to challenge the world around you. Our communities need your leadership, your problem-solving skills, your drive and determination. The choices you make from this day forward have the potential to affect change in a way you've never seen before. The class of 2020 will not settle for the way things have always been. You will continue to work hard. You will not choose the path of least resistance. Instead, you will subscribe to a way of life that leads to something bigger than yourselves. Your communities are counting on you to do great things. Class of 2020, congratulations and God bless each of and every one of you. It has truly been my pleasure to be able to share this time with each of you. We are all so very proud of each one of you.